Clarky, well played. What was that one like for you and the team? I mean, obviously, it was an honour to play today. I mean, I'm delighted that I got in the team uh, this season. So, we obviously, we've got a few struggles in, in the defensive area. I think that's six centre halves out now. But uh, obviously, I was delighted to uh, get a chance today. I thought started off a little bit slow, if I'm, if I'm being personally honest. But I built my way into the game, I think. And second half, I, I, I tried to, to play my normal game and get the ball down and get forward. So, uh, overall, I thought I played all right. What did you make of the team's performance? Absolute battle. Uh, every single man to a tee, absolute battle. I think that's probably the best clean sheet we'll get all season, to be honest. Um, it was tough. They had, they had threats coming forward in the first half, long throws. But, I mean, we dealt with everything that came in our box. And in the end, we ended up creating plenty of chances in the second half and could have gone on to get all three points. Let's speak about that first half, which was marred by the injury towards George Maris. I'm sure it will affect uh, affected you greatly. Can you take us through it? Yeah, I mean, obviously... The ball's gone out to the left centre half and he's tried to clip the ball inside and I thought I could read it. But uh, as I'm coming, I've heard a late shout of George and um, unfortunately, he's, 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 I think he's hit his head on my, on my shoulder or my, my arm or whatever. But I saw him walking down downstairs, so he seems to be all right. Um, but I, from then on, obviously, it's tough for me. But um, I just tried to get my head over it and get back to the game and just play as normal. Have you had the chance to, to, to speak to him to see how he is? Yeah, I spoke to him downstairs. I did apologise. He said, obviously, it wasn't my fault. It was just one of those things that happened in football coming together. It was probably a lack of communication on both both parts. So, uh, overall, I think it was all right. Not too bad. You did so well after that, Clarky, because I thought that it might have played on your mind. No, yeah, I mean, I, I've practised this with myself, getting over mistakes, getting over things that have happened in the game. So, I tried to just put it to the back of my mind and get on with it as usual. And on the whole, um, what did you make of Mansfield in both halves today? Defensively, as I said, I thought we battled really well, very well indeed, um, with the long throws that were coming into the box, corners that were coming into the box, they had a lot of aerial threats, um, but Elliot Macker in the second half, El uh, Ollie Hawkins in the first half won absolutely every header, uh, Ryan Burke when he came on was outstanding as well, uh, and then going forward, obviously we're creating the chances, I think our luck will turn in front of goal, it's just just not quite falling for us at the minute, I mean we're unlucky, unlucky not to get a penalty in the end, I thought that was very harsh to uh, be given as a dive, but um, maybe if that was against us it probably would have been given, but it's just one of those things, uh, our tide will turn definitely, um, and it's a positive performance overall. You must be so pleased with yourself reflecting on that 90 minutes, especially marking players like Baham Bula because he's a real handful. Yeah, definitely. I mean, the uh, the gaffer gave me the armband on Tuesday midweek, which gave me massive confidence. And uh, obviously, them playing me today, I felt like I could really step up into the first team. And I mean, yeah, <laughs> uh, Hambula, is that, I don't know how to Bahambula. pronounce it. Yeah, yeah, but uh, he was a real handful and he's got great feet. And I mean, it's, it's one of those things I'm going to have to deal with in football. Uh, as, as my pick career progresses, I'm going to have to uh, deal with players like that. So I thought it's a real learning curve for me and hopefully I can, I can build on that. It's a real opportunity for now, isn't it, to, to really stake a regular place for the, uh, for the starting eleven, keeping the shirt off Kellen Gordon, if you like. Yeah, I mean, obviously, Kellen's fantastic and he's a great, great uh, competitor. Um, at the minute, I think he's probably quite slightly ahead of me. Uh, obviously, he's out injured at the minute, but I've just got to do everything I can to get into the team. Um, but he's a great lad and he works hard, so it, it's a battle between both of us and the gaffer will be the one to decide that. Do you consider that a point gained or two lost today? Definitely a point gained in the end. Um, although some might see it as, as uh, two dropped, I think the situation we've got 10 players missing I think at the minute so uh, the lads really dug deep with the squad that we've got and overall I, I'm really happy with the nil-nil performance especially with the clean sheets as a defender. What is the squad feeling at the moment? How, how is its assessment of the, the current injury crisis because it's quite unprecedented the amount of players who are out injured? Yeah it's it's tough it's <laughs> I don't think I've ever, ever experienced anything like it before um, but we're a real tight-knit group and even the lads who are injured are always in and around the group having, having the banter with the lads and the camaraderie between everyone is fantastic so it, it's not getting anyone down obviously it's, it's disappointing for the lads who aren't playing but I think the lads who are getting the chance to play now through through luck of, of injury of other players I mean they've got they've got a chance to step up into the team like the likes of Ryan Burke me today Keaton came into the team today as well so I mean it's just it's a real opportunity for the lads who haven't been playing um, to push on and really get a chance to stick in the team. Well done today Clarky. Cheers Steve. -o.